hyperthymesia supermemory. This condition is called hyperthymesia. This isn't your typical memory boost, but a rare condition where people remember every detail of their lives. Only around 60 people worldwide have been diagnosed with this unusual ability. Imagine being able to recall any random day from your childhood, crystal clear. That's not all. People with hyperthymesia can quote entire passages from books they read years ago, relive specific news stories, practically anything. Sounds like a superpower, right? Well, not exactly. Unlike forgetting unpleasant experiences, those with hyperthymesia are stuck with everything. They literally remember it all, the good, the bad, and the awkward. Take Rebecca Sherrick, an Australian writer featured by BBC. Her memory is mind-blowing. She can recall being swaddled in a pink blanket as a newborn. She can even recite whole sections of Harry Potter flawlessly. But Rebecca doesn't see her hyperthymesia as a gift. In fact, it comes with constant headaches, trouble sleeping, and exhaustion. Analgesia, feeling no pain, ever. Inborn analgesia, that's the scientific term for this unusual condition where people are completely pain insensitive. Here's a mind-boggling fact. Despite its rarity, over 40 cases were documented in a single Swedish village. Makes you wonder about the meatballs, right? Just kidding, probably. Forget superhero fantasies. This syndrome doesn't affect your mind or appearance. It simply turns off the pain receptors. Sounds cool on the surface, right? Well, in the real world, it's a recipe for trouble. Pain is our body's way of, way of screaming, hey, something's wrong. Without it, people with analgesia can miss crucial warning signs. It's especially dangerous for children who might injure themselves playing, damage their eyes, or even bite their tongue without realizing it. Broken bones could go unnoticed for days. So maybe think twice before wishing for a life without pain. Savant syndrome. Savant syndrome is a rare condition that can occur in people with autism or Asperger's syndrome. It grants them incredible talents in areas like music, art, math, math, mapping, and even 3D modeling. Imagine instantly calculating complex multiplications or predicting the day of the week centuries in the future. That's what savants can do. Take Stephen Wiltshire, a famous British artist with savant syndrome. He drew a detailed map of London after just one helicopter ride. Their abilities are truly impressive, leading some to call them geniuses, and they'd be partly right. Savants have exceptional talent in specific areas. However, it's important to remember that these islands of genius often exist alongside intellectual or social challenges. Unlike the movie character Forrest Gump, haven't read the book either, but great movie, savants don't necessarily have well-rounded abilities. Insensitivity to cone tolerance is a well-documented phenomenon, but there's a whole other world for those who defy the cold. Wim Hof, the Dutch Iceman, exemplifies this perfectly. He's left scientists scratching their heads with his ability to conquer bone-chilling temperatures. Imagine enduring a 120-minute icy bath, scaling the peak of Mont Blanc clad only in shorts, or swimming beneath the frozen surface of a lake. That's Wim Hof's reality. While medical professionals consider him a unique anomaly, Hoff himself credits his resilience to years of rigorous training. Whether it's a natural predisposition or the fruit of unwavering dedication, his ability to embrace the cold is nothing short of extraordinary. Think about it. With such a superpower, your winter wardrobe anxieties would become a thing of the past. Absence of fear. Imagine a life devoid of fear. Not a controlled bravery, but a complete absence. This is the reality for those with urbach wiethe disease, a rare genetic condition affecting only about 300 documented cases worldwide. South Africa holds a disproportionate number with a quarter of diagnosed cases. One such case, known anonymously as SM, has become emblematic, the woman who knows no fear. Researchers put SM through a battery of fear tests, holding venomous creatures, watching horror movies, even being locked in a haunted house. All in vain. SM remained unfazed, even recounting terrifying experiences from her own life, like a nighttime knife attack or brutal domestic violence, failed to elicit fear. The lead researcher expressed genuine concern for SM's safety, highlighting the danger of someone unable to perceive threats. While the idea of being fearless might sound appealing, SM's story reveals a darker side, a life potentially cut short due to the lack of a vital survival instinct. The Vampire Disorder Forget the spooky name, hypohydrotic ectodermal dysplasia, HED, might be a mouthful, 
but its more common moniker, vampire disease, is a bit misleading. Sure, some with HED can have pointed teeth, adding a resemblance to those legendary bloodsuckers. Throw in potential symptoms like pale skin, dark circles, and hair loss, and the comparison becomes even more pronounced. But the real struggles of HED lie far beyond a resemblance to Dracula. Unlike vampires, those with this condition have a malfunctioning thermoregulatory system. They lack sweat glands, making it crucial to constantly monitor their temperature and avoid heat, including sunlight. Imagine your body overheating without the ability to cool down through sweat. That's the daily reality for people with HED. Here's the surprising twist. Actor Michael Berryman, known for his iconic horror roles, actually has HED. His unique appearance, a result of the condition, ironically landed him the very roles that perpetuate the vampire disease myth. So, the next time you hear about the vampire disease, remember, the truth behind HED is far less frightening and far more about managing a complex medical condition. Octopus people, polymelia, a condition where individuals are born with extra limbs, presents a fascinating medical mystery. While some cases involve functional limbs offering a potential advantage, others deal with non-functioning appendages. Imagine the mixed emotions of having an extra arm, helpful or hindrance. But polymelia can go beyond mere duplicates. A particularly striking case involved a baby in Pakistan born with six legs, a consequence of a parasitic twin. This condition can affect any extremity, legs, arms, fingers, and even, in rare instances, the penis. Surgery offers a solution to remove these extra limbs. However, some individuals, surprisingly, choose against it. They might find these extra appendages, particularly extra fingers, surprisingly useful and develop an attachment to them, making the decision to remove them a difficult one. Stone Man Syndrome Stone Man Syndrome, also known as Fibrodysplasia ossificans progressiva, FOP, is a debilitating genetic disorder with a cruel progression. Individuals with FOP witness their soft tissues, like muscles, tendons, and ligaments, gradually transform into bone. This horrifying metamorphosis is caused by a mutation in the ACVR1 gene, which plays a vital role in tissue development. The consequence? Muscles harden into bone and joints become permanently fused, stealing mobility and constricting the body in a self-made prison of bone. Surgery offers no solace. Attempts to remove the extra bone tissue only trigger a devastating response. The body produces even more bone in that area. The rarity of FOP, affecting only one in two million people, offers little comfort as there is currently no cure or effective treatment for this relentless condition. Werewolf Syndrome Ever feel like you spend way too much time battling unwanted body hair? Spare a thought for those with hypertrichosis, also known as werewolf syndrome. This condition throws normal hair growth out the window, blanketing the body in a thick, dark coat that extends to areas typically devoid of hair, like the face. The culprit behind this excessive furriness is most often a genetic mutation. However, some cases have been linked to medications used to combat balding, a cautionary tale for those those seeking a fuller head of hair. While trusty hair removal methods like shaving, waxing, or lasers can offer some relief, their effects are temporary. Imagine the constant battle of keeping unwanted hair at bay. Hypertrichosis presents a unique challenge, both aesthetically and in terms of daily maintenance. Foreign Accent Syndrome Imagine suddenly developing a foreign accent, not through practice or travel, but seemingly overnight. This is the bizarre reality of foreign accent syndrome, FAS. People with FAS find themselves unintentionally speaking with an accent that differs from their native tongue. The twist? They've never set foot in the country their accent seems to hail from. Cases range from individuals inexplicably speaking French without ever having visited France to those who flit between multiple accents, sometimes even simultaneously. So what triggers this perplexing condition? Head injuries and strokes are the most common culprits. These incidents can disrupt the brain regions responsible for speech production, including how the tongue is positioned during speaking. While fast can be disconcerting, there's hope. Speech therapy has proven to be an effective treatment, helping individuals with FAS regain control over their speech patterns. So, the next time you hear someone with an unusual accent, remember, it might not be a tourist. It could be a fascinating case of foreign accent syndrome.
Out of all the unusual medical conditions we explored, which one surprised you the most? Have you ever encountered someone with any of these conditions? Share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below. Remember to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and don't forget to subscribe for more fascinating content.